gets me every three or four months. Denny so. Hamlin victorious really at Watkins Glen. Really doubted uh, being in the race for a day, to be honest with you. Joe Gibbs, Toyota. Horsepower getting it done. He blew up the tires, so. <laughs> and he's walking pretty gingerly. <laughs> FedEx Freight. Madison Martin looking very sexy. Denny Hamlin having back problems. So that was the cheese it. 355 at Watkins Glen. How are you doing? Hope you're having a great day. Denny Hamlin getting it done. A lot of different drivers thought they had this race right here. Um, but let's get to the race review real quick. We started the race. We had a Toyota pace car. Jeff Gordon got into the three. Um, he spun around. We didn't have any caution after that little incident. Let me turn this down a little bit. Uh, the first caution was for debris. Which, I wonder, like, we never see this debris. Is this really, is, are these debris cautions happening, or are they happening just to give us an uh, entertaining race? Let me know what you guys think about that one. We also had Danica Patrick. She stayed out, led a, a bunch of laps. I think maybe five laps. We could take a look real quickly here, see how many she led. Um... Danica led 11 laps today. After that, we had a caution for... Uh, the second caution was out for a loose wheel on pit road. Third caution was a big one. The 16-17. Greg Biffle, Ricky Stenhouse Jr., Jimmy Johnson, and the three all got into a little crash there. It started with the 17 losing control out of the carousel. Um, looks like he hit the rumble strip on, at the exit of uh, the carousel and spun across the track um, down the narrow part. And the 48 ended up clipping him. So, the fourth caution. Well, oh yeah, that third caution also bring out the red flag, guys. So, we had, like, some delay. Denny Hamlin getting it done here, though, guys. So, give him a round of applause. Denny Hamlin. Um, fourth caution was for the 19, the 23, the 15, and the 30. Uh, Reagan spun out. Um, basically caused all of this. Or I'm not really uh, sure. I forgot what I got written down and I forgot. Fifth caution was for debris. More of this mystery caution stuff. Where's the debris pieces coming from? Who knows? The sixth caution was for Alex Kennedy. I think he blew up. And then he parked next to the grass, which started on fire from the oil, I think, underneath the car or something like that. Um, after that caution, we had a restart. It was a crazy restart. The 31 spun out. The 83 spun out. So that bring up caution number seven. Um, the 23 and the 4 were, were in the carousel, and they just accordion affected, and Harvick was the big loser of it. He spun around. I think David Reagan ended up hitting his radiator in pretty good or something like that. I'm not too sure. Um, last restart. Oh, wait, that caution also bring out a red flag. So we here we are getting towards the end of the race. Um, the last restart, the two spun the 78 um, at the end of the race. Um, also, we had Kyle Larson. Uh, the 47 ended up doing an accordion effect to him spinning Kyle Larson out down pit road, which looked like a pretty violent hit. Um, we have two who will win winners this week. So two guys picked Denny Hamlin. Good job. You... You really did it. Out of all the people that picked, only two guys got it right. Um, let's take a look at Denny Hamlin here. So those two winners are Joshua Harris and Major Mike Barracuda. G good job, guys. You all you said Denny Honey Hamlin would get his second win of this season, and he did it. So that was the cheese at 3:55 at the Glen. We had a total race time. 
of two hours and 43 minutes. We had 90 laps run and 90 were scheduled. We had eight cautions for 20 laps. The fastest lap of, I don't even know if that's right. We had eight leaders, nine different lead changes. 40 cars started the race at the end. There was 33 with a temperature of 81 degrees Fahrenheit. So let's get to your leaderboard rundown. She's at 55 at the Glen winner. Denny Hamlin leads 10 laps. It gets it done. Joey Logano finishes second. Third is Brad Keselowski. AJ Allmendinger spins the 42. He finishes fourth. Tony Stewart finishes fifth. Kyle Busch finishes sixth. Jay McMurray is seventh. Eighth is Martin Truex Jr. Trevor Bain is ninth. Matt Kenseth finishes tenth. Kurt Busch is eleventh. Twelfth is Casey Mears. Thirteenth is Chase, Chase Elliott. Fourteenth is Jeff Gordon. Fifteenth is Ryan Newman. Sixteenth is Carl Edwards, who won my Cheese at 100 simulation. Uh, he was leading quite a bit of the race. I was really thinking, wow, that simulation might be really accurate. But Kyle or Carl Edwards ends up finishing 16th. Michael McDowell is 17th. Clint Boyer is 18th. Casey Kane is 19th. 20th is Ryan Blaney. 21st, like I said, leads 11 laps today. She finishes 21st. That's Nick Patrick. 22nd is Paul Menard. 23rd is... Landon Castle, Boar said, comes back to Spring Cup Series. He finishes 24th. Brian Scott's 25th. Josh Wise is 26th. Eric Elmerol is 27th. Cole Witt finishes 28th. Kyle Larson, it says he, he's marked at 29th overall. 30th is Chris Busher. He's one lap down. Austin Dillon's 31st. Kevin Harvick is seven laps down. 37th. Second. David Reagan's 33rd. Matt D. Benenetos finishes 34th. David Reagan's 35th. 36th is Alex Kennedy. Michael Lynette finishes 37th. Ricky Stenhouse Jr. finishes 38 laps down. He's in 38th. 38th. Greg Biffle finishes 39th. And last place belongs to J Boom, Jimmy Johnson. He took last place uh, 50 or 38 laps down. <laughs> So, um, that was the Cheese at 355 at the Glen. No racing next week, guys, so find something to do. But after that, August 20th, we head to Bristol Motor Speedway for the Bass Pro Shops NRA Night Race. And that's going to be on um, NBCSN, also PRN. And then August 28th, Sunday, it's the Pure Michigan 400 at Michigan International Speedway. And then we're already in the month of September. And September 4th is the Bojangles Southern 500 at Darlington Raceway. So once again, we only had two winners for who will win. Joshua Harris and um, Major Mike Barracuda. They knew a Toyota would get it done here. And uh, they got, you know, they got it right. So congrats to them too. Thanks to everybody who plays, who will win. I really appreciate it. We've seen a lot of action go on right here today on the track. Probably more than was recommended. Kevin Harvick crashing right up over here with a little uh, help from Reagan. That sure finished that. Um, so yeah, pretty cool. Pretty good day. Well, until I guess two weeks from now, we will see you guys in the guys.